The first thing you probably notice about this clip, if you aren't already used to it, is how bright my colors are in Valorant. And if you haven't seen this before, you're probably thinking, hmm, I want my colors like that too. Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to achieve these colors in your game and explain my reasoning behind why I have my color settings like this in Valorant. Before I actually do a little tutorial on how to make this change to your game slash PC in general, I just want to list off some reasonings as to why I have my colors changed like this. And I'm sure why other people have their colors brightened as well. So if you guys just stay to the end of the video, just listen to these reasonings and see if any of them line up with you and see if you agree with any of them. And then towards the end, you can decide if you want to change your colors as well. But I highly suggest changing them just because of my first reasoning, which is simply, it just looks really good. Having your colors brightened, especially in Valorant, which is already a pretty colorful game, just makes the experience a lot more fun and enjoyable to look at. Lifting your colors, or more specifically your digital vibrance, just brings all those muted colors that Valorant has to offer to life and brightens them a lot more. But I do want to stress that there is a difference between saturation and digital vibrance. If you lift your saturation, it kind of just brings every single color up and just warms the entire screen. And if you raise it up too much, it can just wash out your game or your screen or your monitor or whatever a little bit too much with too much warmth in your colors. But if you lift your digital vibrance, which you will be doing when you make these color changes, this will just bring out all those muted colors a little bit more, make them pop, and it should leave those already saturated colors kind of where they're at already. Other than making the game look really nice and just overall enhancing your Valorant color experience, having your vibrance up just helps you distinguish different parts of the map better. Even though you're not raising your contrast, I feel like brightening those dull colors just helps you contrast a little bit more of the map, whichever one that may be that you're playing on. And this in turn can help you line up things better if you're setting up lineups with Sova or Viper or whatever agent that might be. And it just helps you distinguish better what you're looking at around the map, whether that may be an enemy at a specific part of the map that may be hard to see because of dull colors originally and it might help you aim and line up your shots more accurately as well and branching off of that since valorant is already a very colorful game this will definitely brighten those agent colors and help you contrast them against the map as well which again will allow you to see what you're shooting at a lot clearer and more contrasted which will in turn like i said help you line up those shots a little bit easier and ensure that what you're aiming at is what you're aiming at so the thing that is unique to Valorant that I think digital vibrance boosting will help the most with is just the outline colors. As you guys may know, you can change your Valorant highlight color by just going into your colorblind settings and changing it to purple, yellow, or red, and whatever outline color you do have this on, brightening that digital vibrance will again boost that color just a lot more and help your eyes see that and be more in tune and be able to catch it a lot easier, whether someone's coming around a corner that you didn't expect or just being able to catch an enemy in your peripheral visions at the side of your screen or at long distances lifting this digital vibrance and boosting your colors in valorant will help you spot that a lot easier which will hopefully help your reaction time and allow you to just quickly snap to whatever enemy that is and to help you get that kill more accurately all right so now that i've listed off some of those reasons as to why changing your colors or brightening your colors in valorant can actually help you i'm sure you guys have decided if you want to do it or not or you've probably just skipped to this part of the video so without any further ado let's just show you guys how you can change this specifically i'm doing this on my pc which has an nvidia card i believe it's somewhat similar if you do have an amd card so if someone that has done it on an amd card wants to post below just spam the frick out of it with likes so it gets to the top of the comments so that everyone else with an amd card can see as well all right guys so to start off what you want to do is just go to your main desktop home screen from here you want to right click and then just go right into nvidia control panel and like i said with the amd cards i believe it's something similar here it should say AMD. i honestly have no idea <laughs> so again if you guys do have an amd card please let us know down in the comments below what that is and if this even pertains to changing the vibrance on your amd card so once you have your nvidia control panel opened up you want to go to the display tab and then look for adjust desktop color settings i believe if you guys do have a laptop you may not be able to see this and i honestly do not know if this will work on laptops or not but i believe some people have done it so if you guys again have done it on a laptop which i have not or else i would tell you guys please let us know in the comments below spam the frick out of it so we can all see it and uh so the homies with the laptops in the amd cards can see I'll also make sure to put it in my pinned comment as well that I always have on the top of my videos. So click on adjust desktop color settings. And from here, you should obviously select the monitor that you do want to change the uh, vibrance on. I have a BenQ 240 Hertz monitor. I have this one selected, which is my main monitor. And then all you want to do from here is just scroll down to digital vibrance and bump this up to whatever you want. It should be defaulted on 50. I prefer mine in 75, but I know some people will take it all the way up to 100 for really, really bright colors. I've just been using 75 for 
you know, years now and I've preferred it. I like how it looks and I plan to keep it there. It's just a nice little boost to those dull colors and it just brightens everything and makes it all more vibrant as well on not just Valorant, but any game I'm playing and just on my overall PC user experience in general. From there, once you have it set to what you want, just hit apply and then that's literally all you need to do exit out and you're good to go also if any of you guys were wondering i know a lot of people used to use like the game overlay or some sort of like in-game enhancement that valorant used to have but they took it away i believe this is pretty much the only way that you can do this at the moment there's probably some programs out there that you can use to brighten your vibrance or your colors in game but i think just doing this on your pc within your pc and your graphics card settings is probably the best way you could do it and to just answer any other questions you guys may have like is this bannable no it is completely safe you do not have to worry about getting banned for using this all this is doing is just obviously like you saw lifting those colors that your computer and your gpu are putting out it's not messing with the game at all through any third-party software although there's probably ways to do that like i said i know there was that valorant like game filter that you could use before but valorant decided to take that away so even though you can still do this it's not bannable and it's not against any riot terms of service or anything all this is doing is just giving you a little bit more of that advantage and you're just using that tool at your disposal through your gpu to just brighten those colors and it may not even be for everyone but personally through my experience and i know a lot of pros do this and just other players in general they will just brighten those colors to just help them pop out more since valorant is already a very bright game through a lot of different colors but if you can just take them up a little bit more contrast between the map and the agents and just lift those colors to catch your eye a little bit more i'll always take that advantage if it helps me play better in game and if anyone else is wondering if you guys do have a little bit lower end of a PC, I do not believe this affects your performance at all. Or if it does, it's got to be very, very minuscule. I have not noticed any crazy performance hitches or any negative GPU performance from boosting my colors. I can see how it would make your GPU work a little bit harder. But in the end, I do not believe that this is going to affect anything performance related. And you're not going to notice any drop in FPS or performance in Valorant or anything. So that is going to do it for this video today, guys. I really, really hope you take this into account. Try it out for yourself see if boosting those colors does help you out in game like i said it may not be for everyone but personally i just like the way it looks i like how it helps me out in game and it also just brightens everything on my computer no matter if i'm just watching a video or playing other games it makes everything look really nice and just takes those colors up a little bit more who doesn't like colors you know colors are cool but if you guys have any other questions again make sure to ask them in the comments below and please 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 if you guys do have an amd card or a laptop you have a way to do that on your amd card or personally on your nvidia gpu on your laptop please let us know in the comments below and again spam the frick out of that comment so it reaches the top of the comments and like i said i'll put it in my pinned comment so it can make it easier for everyone to find any other questions ask away in the comments and if you guys do want to come ask me live in my stream or just watch me play valorant i do stream on twitch every single monday through thursday at 1 p.m eastern there you can ask me any questions or just hang out with the community it's a very welcoming community and it's a very chill stream to be in just hanging out playing some valorant and talking to everyone so i hope you guys come through and say what's up also check all my socials down in the description below i'm really trying to work on my instagram if you guys have not followed make sure to do so on my instagram don't forget to use my code at gfuel checkout for 10 to 30 percent off just code iridium at gfuel checkout you'll get 10 percent off and again sometimes 30 percent i believe this coming week it's going to be boosted to 30 percent so if you need a restock for the summer make sure to do so and use my code at checkout so with all that being said hopefully catch you guys on the twitch stream and i will for sure catch you guys in the next video i post every tuesday thursday and saturday so make sure to turn on those notifications and subscribe and like if you guys are not already see you guys in the next one and on that note ta-ta for now